I went and visited a friend of mine today down on Manhattan Beach, and uh, I have a number of friends that have recently moved out there, and they keep telling me, oh, dude, you got to fucking move out here. It's awesome. You know, you can walk around. Everything's fucking cool. First time I go down there, there's this crazy homeless guy, right, who will just be walking around muttering, and then out of nowhere he just fucking yell so loud and, like, throw this crazy punch and every time it scared the fuck out of me and I knew it was coming. He'd be just walking, going, No, he just kept going, bah! And he'd just fucking throw this punch. And every time it made me give me like a little fucking heart attack, like what's his face in Biloxi Blues. And um, so I'm thinking, all right, it's nighttime. You know, the beach is just like, you know, it just, tri- it just attracts so many fucking losers. You know, because their whole deal is like, even if I fuck up, I can still survive and live outside, curl up in the warm sand. You know what I mean? So anyways, um, I'm walking down there today with my buddy. It's during the day and it's more like family time. And I'm walking down the fucking street, right? And there's like these two fucking girls. I don't know how old they were, but they didn't have any curves yet. And they're wearing these bikinis and they got like three quarters of their ass that they don't even have yet hanging out of the back of it and i'm looking at my buddy and i'm going like dude why are those little girls like they were like fucking 12 walking with their asses what what is what the fuck is wrong with parents today i want to walk up to parents and just be like that's okay with you do you ever watch to catch a predator what the fuck are you doing can you put your kids asses away please fucking worst parent they literally should they somebody should just come up and just i don't know what what do you fucking just dump a bucket of ice water over their parents head and just scream wake up you know people if you have young children can you cover them up jesus christ that that was so creepy it should have been in one of those fucking uh who, who's a guy who does it used to be uh calvin klein had the creepy fucking prepubescent fucking kids like locked in the cellar remember those fucking commercials and it was like the guy off camera just being like so what do you like to do for fun oh yeah those jeans are kind of falling off your hips aren't they (laughs) that's fucking awful that awful commercial my favorite one ever jim the taxi driver that donnell logue did you ever see when he did i can't find it but he did a parody of that and he was sitting there with like his, his pants half pulled down, answering the questions of some creepy guy off. Oh, it's fucking hilarious. But then the latest American apparel. You know that creepy fucking feeling you get if you're any sort of a human being when you look at an American apparel ad? You know, I actually tweeted about it one time. You're, like, you're pulling up to it and, you know, old man, you're fucking pulling up with your bad eyes going, Jesus, look at the ass on that ass. He's only 12, right? That's the same thing. That's the same fucking feeling today. It's like, what the, why? Who's the fucking creep that makes a bathing suit for a little girl like that? You know, I don't know. Whoever it is, he, he go, he call, he goes by uncle. That's always a fucking, that's always a dead giveaway. When somebody's in their forties, they're not married, Right. And they're still hanging out with people half their age. And, he, and they go, oh, just call me fucking uncle whatever. That's when you immediately have to leave. And, and if there's any drink in the room, don't drink it. Right? My fucking nuts. That's, that's just what I believe. Parents, I mean, I, who am I? I don't have any fucking kids. I shouldn't say that. But for the love of God, you know, if, if your kid's like, you know. If you add your kid's age. <laughs> it's like. Under five, you know, one plus two, three. You know what I'm saying? That probably the math. I shouldn't use a math equation. I'm too fucking dumb for that. I'm just saying. You know what the fuck I'm saying? And then it makes you feel like a fucking creep. It's like, would you get that out of here, please? Horrific, horrific parenting. 